Hi, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I will tell you about Hey Star Trek fans. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, where I share with you the latest news and reviews on everything Star Trek. Today, I'm going to talk about one of the most amazing and groundbreaking episodes of Star Trek, Strange New Worlds, the musical episode called Subspace Rhapsody. Yes, you heard me right, a musical episode. Star Trek. Strange New Worlds goes where no Trek has gone before with Subspace Rhapsody, and I'm here to tell you why you need to watch it as soon as possible. Subspace Rhapsody is the ninth episode of Season 2 of Star Trek. Strange New Worlds, the spin-off series that follows the adventures of Captain Christopher Pike and his crew on the U.S. Enterprise. The episode is written by Kosha Runners, Akiva Goldsman, and Henry Alonso Myers, and directed by Dermot Downs. The episode features six original songs written by Kay Hanley and Tom Poles, who are members of the rock band Letters to Cleo. The songs are performed by the cast members of Star Trek, Strange New Worlds, who showcase their singing and dancing talents in this musical extravaganza. The plot of the episode is that the Enterprise encounters a quantum probability field that alters their reality and makes them operate by the rules of a parallel universe where everyone sings all the time. This also creates a problem when the quantum field starts spreading to other ships and threatens to destabilize the whole galaxy. The Enterprise crew has to find a way to reverse the effect of the quantum field while also dealing with their personal issues and emotions through song. The episode is a delight for both Star Trek fans and musical fans, as it combines sci-fi elements with musical tropes. The episode pays homage to classic musicals, such as The Sound of Music, West Side Story, and Grease, as well as modern musicals, such as Hamilton, La La Land, and The Greatest Showman. The episode also explores the themes and characters of Star Trek. Strange new worlds in a deeper and more emotional way as they express their feelings and motivations through song. The songs are catchy, witty, and heartfelt, and they fit perfectly with the personalities and moods of the characters who sing them. For example, Pike sings a heroic ballad called To Boldly Go, Spock sings a logical rap called The Needs of the Many, Wura sings a soulful anthem called Hear Me Roar, and Lion and Chapel sing a romantic duet called You Are My Home. The songs also advance the plot and the character development, as they reveal secrets, conflicts, and resolutions that affect the outcome of the episode. The Cast Members of Star Trek Strange New Worlds do an incredible job performing the songs and dances in this episode. Some of them are already experienced singers and dancers, such as Celia Rosegooding, who plays Yura, and Carol Kane, who plays Dr. Mbenga. Others were more nervous about their musical abilities, such as Anson Mount, who plays Pike, and Christina Chong, who plays Lion. However, they all rose to the challenge and delivered amazing performances that surprised and impressed the showrunners. The cast also had a lot of fun filming the musical episode, as they got to show a different side of their characters and themselves. Subspace Rhapsody is a milestone for the Star Trek franchise, as it is the first time that Star Trek has done a full-blown musical episode with original songs and choreography. It is also a testament to the creativity and innovation of Star Trek. Strange New Worlds which is not afraid to try new things and experiment with different genres and formats. The showrunners said that they are very proud of what they achieved with this episode, and that they hope it will inspire more musical episodes in Star Trek's future. So what are you waiting for? Go watch Subspace Rhapsody right now on Paramount Plus, or check out some of the clips and behind-the-scenes videos on YouTube. Trust me, you won't regret it. It's one of the best episodes of Star Trek ever made. And if you have watched it already, let me know what you think in the comments below. What was your favorite song? Which character surprised you the most with their singing voice? And did you want to see more musical episodes on Star Trek? Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more Star Trek content. Thanks for watching. Live long and prosper. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and give feedback.